India has made one of its boldest moves yet in the global AI infrastructure race. Adani Enterprises, through its joint venture Adani Connex, has partnered with Google to build India's largest AI data, data center campus in Vishakhapantam, Andhra Pradesh. A $15 billion investment over five years, a gigawatt scale AI campus, and a strategic bet that positions India as a critical node in the world's compute economy. This is not just another hyperscale center. This is actually India saying it's no longer just consuming AI but building the rails it will run on. The announcement was led by Gautam Adani, who called it this, a monumental day for India, end quote. He wrote that Adani is proud to partner with Google to build India's largest AI data center campus, engineered specifically for the demands of artificial intelligence. This facility will house the TPU and GPU-based compute power required for deep learning, neural network training, and large-scale AI model inference, creating an ecosystem that accelerates AI-driven solutions for India's most critical sectors, from healthcare and agriculture to logistics and finance. The partnership marks a strategic convergence between India's fastest-growing infrastructure conglomerate and one of the world's most powerful AI players. It signals the emergence of India as a major player in the global compute economy at a time when AI infrastructure is becoming the new geopolitical power currency. The Google Adani AI Hub represents a $15 billion investment between 2026 and 2030. It will be built on gigawatt scale capacity powered entirely by green energy and connected to global networks through a dedicated subsea cable system. The campus will be purpose-built to support the training of massive neural networks, foundation model development and inference at scale capabilities critical to the next wave of AI innovation. Backed by Airtel, Adani Connex and Google, the hub is expected to anchor India's AI era enabling industries ranging from healthcare and agriculture to finance, logistics, manufacturing and advanced research to scale their AI capabilities without relying entirely on foreign infrastructure. Vishakhapatnam is not just another coastal city under Andhra Pradesh's Greater Vishakha Economic Corridor, Vizag is becoming positioned as the AI and data capital of India. In 2024, Andhra Pradesh IT Minister Nara Lokesh personally drove Google executives to the site. Since then, the state and central governments have worked together to clear regulatory bottlenecks and provide unprecedented clarity on taxation, energy infrastructure, subsea landing rights and land access to market value. The project is expected to create 188,000 jobs and add over 10,000 crore rupees annually to Andhra Pradesh's GSDP between 2028 and 2032. Beyond its economic impact, the move establishes Vizag as a strategic gateway between India and global AI infrastructure networks, positioning the city at the center of the compute map. This announcement comes, well, in the backdrop of the latest move in a string of strategic bets that have been quietly reshaping India's AI infrastructure map over the past 12 months. First came TCS, with its $6 billion investment to build India's first 1 gigawatt AI data center. That moment marked the shift from Indian IT serving AI to Indian IT building the backbone of AI. Then came Meta, docking its $10 billion Waterworth subsea cable in Vizag and Mumbai, turning India into one of the most critical nodes in the global AI data infrastructure network. And now, Google and Adani have entered the picture with a $15 billion AI hub, cementing Vishakhapatnam's rise from a port city to, well, a compute capital. When viewed together, these aren't isolated headlines. They form a clear pattern, a strategic stacking of land, cables and compute that mirrors how cities like Singapore, Amsterdam and Virginia became global digital hubs. This is also where 
front page at AIM Network has consistently been ahead of the curve. We've been tracking this shift from the very beginning. When TCS quietly dropped its Gigawatt announcement, when Meta picked Vizag for Waterworth, when Yotta revealed its sovereign GPU roadmap, and now when Google and Adani are anchoring the next wave, India's AI infrastructure story isn't just about being built, it's being accelerated project by project, gigawatt by gigawatt. This development also comes against the backdrop of a crucial moment in the India-United States technology corridor. Just weeks ago, Amazon, Microsoft and Google quietly hit pause on new data center leases in India. Not because demand was weak, but because trade tensions between Washington and New Delhi suddenly made long-term capital deployment riskier. Tariffs were raised to 50% on Indian exports, a $100,000 visa fee was imposed on H-1B applications, and routine hardware imports were caught in unpredictable customs and tariff exposure. What followed was an industry-wide slowdown. Contracts that once took 60 days began crawling past 180. No new hyperscale leases were signed. Lawyers and financiers started adding tariff pass-through and phase deployment clauses to hedge against policy shocks. This was a stress test of India's digital backbone. When the United States hyperscalers paused, domestic and strategic players began to accelerate. First came TCS with its $6 billion bet. Then Meta anchored its $10 billion Waterworth subsea cable in Vizag and Mumbai. And now Google and Adani returns to the table, but not as a hesitant lesser. This time, it's a strategic infrastructure investor. And we want to stress here again that front page at AIM Network was the only publication to have been tracking this shift very closely. From the tariff shock to the hyperscaler pause to India's accelerating sovereign infrastructure push. Well, clearly, this isn't just another deal. It's quite clear, isn't it? It's a geopolitical pivot point. Unlike several Western countries that have paused new data center projects because of power constraints, Andhra Pradesh is building dedicated renewable energy grids for AI infrastructure. A combination of solar, wind and thermal hybrid systems will power the hub along with new transmission lines and storage infrastructure co-funded by Google. This is a part of a broader strategy to build a sustainable compute backbone at a time when global AI infrastructure is struggling with rising energy costs and grid instability. The ability to pair hyperscale compute with clean energy gives India a very strategic edge as global companies look for scalable, cost-efficient alternatives outside the United States and Europe. Basically, Thomas Curian, CEO of Google Cloud, called this a defining moment. This is what he said. To unlock India's massive potential in the AI age, we are investing in the Google AI hub, which will provide the critical foundation to drive growth and enable businesses, researchers, and creators to build and scale with AI. End quote. This will be Google's largest AI hub outside the United States and a cornerstone of its global expansion strategy. The hub will host advanced TPU and GPU infrastructure required for training large-scale AI models and supporting global AI demand. It aligns with Google's broader $85 billion global capex plan for expanding data center and AI infrastructure. For Andhra Pradesh, this project represents far more than a technology investment. It is a transformation of the state's economic landscape. Nara Lokesh, has called it India's largest FDI investment ever. The state has embraced a speed of doing business model, integrating industrial policies, renewable power, connectivity, infrastructure, and incentives to bring mega projects to life before others even break ground. The state has already secured 1.6 gigawatt of data center commitments and is targeting 6 gigawatts over the next five years, supported by policy frameworks across energy, electronics and digital infrastructure. This coordinated model between the state and the central government is what attracted Google to anchor its largest Asia-Pacific AI infrastructure project 
in India. For years, as we know, India has depended on foreign AI infrastructure. Today, that's changing. It is building one of the largest AI data hubs in the world on its own soil. This isn't just about training models. This is genuinely about sovereign compute, economic leverage, and shaping how AI is built and deployed globally. First came hyperscaler clouds, then came GPU shortages. Now, infrastructure has become the new power play. With Google and Adani anchoring in Vishakhapatnam, India has taken a decisive step toward becoming a core node in the global AI supply chain. And finally, this isn't just another data center announcement. It's a strategic signal that India intends to lead the next era of AI infrastructure. Adani and Google, $15 billion, one gigawatt of compute, and Vishakha Patnam at the center of it all.